adverb clauses of time and adverb clauses of reason. Adverb clauses of time begin with words like after, before, while, when. Adverb clauses of reason begin with words like because, as, since. Adverb clauses are dependent clauses. They can't stand alone. They give important information, but they're not complete sentences. To form a complete sentence, we use an adverb clause and a main clause, an independent clause. This is the main part of our sentence, and the adverb clause gives more information. For example, when something happened or why something happened. Let me give you examples. Our first example is a line from the story. Inside, the pipes rattled gently as they radiated heat into the rooms. Let me give you a second example. After I fell asleep, I began to have strange dreams. Do you see the two adverb clauses? Here they are. They're adverb clauses of time. They answer the question, when? When did these events happen? The events are told in the main part of the sentence. The adverb clauses then give information about when. Look closely and you'll see that all the clauses, both dependent and independent, have a subject and a verb. Phrases are shorter groups of words. For example, after reading that story, I began to hear strange sounds in my own home. Our example, after reading that story. This phrase has a verb form, but no subject. That's an important difference between a phrase and a clause. A clause always has a subject and a verb. We can often reduce adverb clauses to shorter phrases. These shorter phrases can give our writing a better flow. They're common in fiction, in the news, in reports. They're less common in conversation. Now, let's look at how we reduce the full adverb clauses to phrases. Hi, welcome back to Ingrid.com. I'm Adam. In today's lesson, we're going to look at the adverb clause. Okay. No. Now, this is reducing adverb clauses. Reducing adverb clauses. Okay, this is the one. Copy English. Reducing an adverb clause. Hello, Osman. Shortening it to a phrase. How are you, teacher? How are you? I'm fine. Thanks for asking. Where I'm is fine too. everybody? What? Where is everybody? Um, I'm fine. No, I say, where is everybody? Ah, I, I don't know. <laughs> okay, let me see. Uh, maybe... Is maybe are lost. <laughs> maybe they are trying to get in. So how are yes. you today? Yes. We can only form a phrase from an adverb clause. In my case, I I was a hard day in my in my in my job. You had a hard day. Who began to have strange dreams? Really? Yes. Why? Because my, my... So the subjects are the same. 
Uh, my my work is is stressful, stressful. Uh, it's stressful. Oh no. <laughs> Teacher, uh, yes. your screen. Yeah, su pantalla se quedó congelada. Ah, se quedó congelada. Okay, sí, no, 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 no. I don't hear you. Ah, uh, you can hear me. In this moment, yes, I can. I, I can hear you. Ah, uh -huh, but you can see me. Or oh, yes, you hear another noise? Uh, yes, I hear uh, other other noise. Yeah, it's, it's a, a video. It's a, it's a video that I'm playing. Remove any helping birds. Ah, okay. 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 It's clear. Now, now what, clear. what about my image? Is my image clear now? Use the present part. Yes, in this moment, okay. yes. Okay. Hello, Ninibe. How are you? And our last step. Keep the time word if okay. it's necessary. Okay. His name is strange, right? Ninive. Ninive. It's a it's strange. It's a strange, strange, a strange name. Is is a strange, and I think is the name of a town or a city in the Bible. Maybe. Do you remember yes. Jonas? Yes. Okay. So Jonas was sent to Ninive. Right? So that's that town. Right. That town. Right. It's right. Anyway. <laughs> right. Okay. It's Very true. good. Very good. People is coming. Yeah. People start to arrive. Very good. <laughs> okay. Let me get something. Hello. 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 <laughs> Hello. Good night. Hello. How are you today? I'm great. And you, teacher? I am, yes, wonderful because okay. you are here. <laughs> because you are here. That's good. Thank you. Okay. How are you? How was your day today? How was your I day worked, today? I worked uh, much. <laughs> ah, you work a lot. Okay. I, I, yes, and, and I had to go to the supermarket for shopping, uh, food for my house. Ah, so you went shopping in the supermarket. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, that's good. Okay, so now uh, I don't know if you can see that I'm writing on the chat. Yes, I can see. Okay. Yes. Okay, very good. So yes. I want you that you look at the chat, okay? Uh, the okay. first one. Uh, we are going to do this one, okay? Okay, so talking about yesterday, yesterday class, and you remember the present perfect, okay? Yes. Okay, so we are going to start reviewing the present perfect, okay? And okay. we said, okay, and for that I want you to go to the, do you have your books available? Uh, uh oh, okay, so get your Wait books. a minute. Okay, okay, no problem, I'll give you a minute. I'll give you a minute, don't Thank worry. You. As a matter of fact, oh. I can give you two minutes. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so get your stuff ready. Okay. Mm. 
Yes, ready. Okay, ready? Okay, so if you go okay. to your book on page. On page, I think 12 or 13, I don't mm -hmm. remember. You will find page, let me tell you, page, uh -huh, here, page 13. Okay, I re I'm ready. You ready? Yes. Okay, I'm going to give you, I'm going to share my screen. Hello, Veronica. What happened yesterday, Veronica? Hi, Veronica. <laughs> Bessie, Daniel, Daniel is here, Oscar. Hi, Veronica. What happened yesterday, Veronica? I can't hear you. I cannot hear you. I cannot hear you. Uh-huh. Now? Yeah, now we can hear you. Sorry, uh, uh, yesterday I had a problem with Wi-Fi. With the? Uh, Wi-Fi? Wi ah, with the Wi-Fi. Okay, okay, no problem. Okay, so I'm going to share the book with you. Okay, page 13. So that we have... Okay. Can you see the book? Yes. 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 Okay. Very good. So, you need one. I don't know what happened here. Okay. So, how to use the present perfect? Look at the examples in the box. Then complete the exercises below. The present perfect tense expresses actions that were started sometime in the past in at not a specific moment. The actions may or may not continue into the present, and they may or might not continue into the future. So we use the helping verb have plus the past participle. And we also use the helping verb has, okay? Plus the past participle, to form the verb that expresses the action. For example, in questions, can you see here? Have takes the first position. Have you yes. lost your mind? Yes, I have lost my mind. No, I haven't lost my mind. So we use have with I, you, we, and they. Have they always sold everything they offer? Yes, they have. No, they haven't. Or yes, they have sold everything they offer. Or no, they haven't sold everything they offer. Now, the next one. Has Alejandro. You see, when I talk about he and she, I use has. When I talk about I, you, we, and they, I use have. And for questions, I use it. The, I use the auxiliary before the subject. Has Alejandro created a new product line? Yes, he has. No, he hasn't. Or, yes, he has created a new product line. Or no, the negative. He hasn't created a new product line. Okay? So here we have this exercise. Now, the, here is the auxiliary verb that they, they want you to use and the verb okay so i will help you with number one what is number one a lot of companies have company have have grown have grown because in the past participle right grown mm -hmm. yes. have grown and because mm -hmm. it's plural is plural we use have mm -hmm. Okay, if it has been only one company, only one company, we would have used yes. has. Yes. Okay, but because it's plural, we use have. Very good, very good. 
Okay, now I want you to do number two. Okay. Right. Me uh, the new members of Product yes. Line have a track, new a market track segment. Okay. Remember a track. I have TV. to use the past. Yes, it's true. Uh-huh. Okay, very good. Yes. Now quick explanation. Quick explanation, okay. Let me see. I'm gonna come over here, okay? Okay, remember, okay, that we use, uh, for example, attract. That is the verb, attract. Uh, attract. Okay, now, the regular verbs, they end in ed, so the past tense is attracted. Are we clear? Yes. 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 yes? For example, yes. we have also copy. It's a regular verb, but the past participle is the same because it's a regular verb. It's copied. Okay. So regular verbs are easy because they end in ed. But I gave you a list of irregular verbs. Irregular verbs, correct? Uh -huh. For example, another one is a... Want. Okay, it's a regular verb. Okay, so the past tense is only by adding ed. Okay. For regular verbs, but not don't add ed to all verbs. So the past tense of attract is attracted. Okay, are we clear? Yes. 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 Okay. Very good. So let's continue. Okay. Very good. We have fourteen participants so far. Okay. So I'm gonna share now the book. We're gonna continue sharing the book. Okay. So. Uh, new members of a product line have attracted new market segments. Very good. Now, number three. Let's see, number three. Let's try with Alicia. Okay. Number three. We, okay. We, we have. Have. Um, we have, I, I don't know. Here is I the verb, Alicia, here is the verb. Look, the verb yes, is there. Yes, yes, yes. I. No, we. Have, we, we have decided, uh -huh. decided, decided to expand on our product. We have decided to expand on our product. You see, and we only add a D because yes. it's a regular verb. We only add a D. Okay, very good. Some okay. companies, let me see, Bessie, number four, some companies, I have a question. Yes, sir. Uh, in, the, in the number three, uh, the auxiliary don't go separate uh, with two. With? Have, uh, for example, we have to decide to, to expand. Decide. We have decided to expand. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, so okay. yeah, remember, we use the auxiliary plus the past participle. This okay. is an extra verb. This is an extra verb. These are called infinitives and gerunds. We're gonna see it later, later in the program, okay? So okay. right here is the main verb. So the main verb is I, I thought, decided. So we have I thought, decided. I thought uh, after auxiliary have uh, put two and then decided. No, take a look. No, no okay. take a look. Are you with me right here? For example, here, they, can you see right here? They, they have, have so. Okay. okay. And in the negative, they haven't sold. Can you see it? They haven't okay. sold. 
The same right here. Yes, he has created, right? Okay. No, okay. he hasn't created. Now, the thing here is I am mixing one verb, one made verb, which is the side, with another verb. And then I have to use infinity, which is two, or Jerome's. Okay, we, we will explain that later. Okay, okay. very good. Okay. So, Bessie, Bessie, number four. Okay, remember, it's negative. Number four is negative. It's telling you right here that it's negative. And the main verb is succeed. Do you understand what is the meaning of succeed? Hello, Bessie, Bessie. Bessie Jovel, are you there, Bessie? Okay, Oscar, help us, please. Okay. Number four, some companies. Some companies have not succeed, succeed, succeed when launching a new product because of their lack of knowledge about the target audience. Okay, very good, very good. I, now, I, I, I have a, I, no, I, I have a question. Yes, some companies is plural. But yeah, have. Yeah, when it's plural, have. when the subject is plural, we use have. And but when the subject is singular. The partner, the partner use, uh, you said has. No, he use have. Some companies. Uh, I hear it. I hear it. I hear Some companies have, have not. He say have not. Yes. Okay. okay. Have has, not has. succeeded. Succeeded. Have not succeeded. Now, let me explain this, okay? Now, here, we are going to talk about contractions, okay? Okay, now, for example, when I say I have, the contraction is, the, the contraction is I, I've. 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 That is the contraction, okay? With apostrophe. Let me see. I'm going to write it again. I. I've. That is the contraction. For example, with you, you have the contraction is you've. That is the contraction. With they, the same thing. They, uh -huh. and with we, and with we, the same thing. With, with. Now, very good. Now, I'm going to erase this, and I'm going to go with the contraction. With he, he has. Okay, what is the contraction? The contraction is? Yes. His, exactly, very good. Okay, mm -hmm. and when we have, she has, the contraction is, she's, okay? Now, we can only make contractions with pronouns, with pronouns, with I, you, we, they. If we use personal names or we use a uh, common nouns we have we cannot make contractions okay we can make contractions for example say the teachers said we can make contractions is that clear mm. yes okay but okay that is one now the contraction of have not have not is having having is having Okay, the contraction, have not, the contraction is having. It's only when you want to be very emphatic, very emphatic, then mm -hmm. you say, they have not come to classes, but because you want to be emphatic. But in, in conversation, you usually use the contractions. Okay, 
The same way, the contraction of has not um, is hasn't. Okay, the contraction of has not is is hasn't. Okay? Mm -hmm. okay, so that is the contraction. Okay, very good. Now you are clear. Very good. So now let's go to the book again. Okay, so we were doing exercise number. Now is number five. So look, some company. What's contraction? Having, having okay. succeeded, succeeded when launching a new product because of their lack of knowledge about the target audience. Okay. Now, questions about vocabulary. Knowledge? What is the knowledge? Name? Conocimiento. Knowledge. Okay. Knowledge. More, more questions. Launching. You remember what is launching? El lanzamiento. Aha, uh -huh. very good, very good. And their lack, lack of. What is the meaning of lack of? No, I don't know. Lack of means escasez. Lack of. Some companies haven't succeeded. What is the meaning of succeed? Eh, eh, éxito. 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 Very good. So some companies haven't succeeded when launching a new product because of their mm -hmm. lack of knowledge. But this is, mm -hmm. algunas compañías no han mm -hmm. tenido éxito cuando no hacen su lanzamiento de un nuevo producto por porque la escasez de conocimiento escasez. acerca de target audience, acerca de su eh, segmento de mercado. ¿Está clear ya? Yes. Okay, now, number five is a question. For number me? Number five is a question. Let me see. Veronica. Me? No. Yes. Okay, Veronica. Don't worry. We're going to do more exercises. Okay? We are okay. going to stop doing exercises until 8.30. Come on. Veronica. Okay. Number five. Number five, remember, when it's a question, the auxiliary goes before, before the pronoun, okay? Okay. okay. Have you ever uh, bought no. any... No, have you ever, have, have you, aha, uh -huh. have you ever bought, I'm sorry, you are right. Uh, okay. Have, you, have, you, uh, ever have bought? you ever bought any highly recognized, recognized? product lines? Uh -huh. recognized product lines. Line. Product lines. Very good. Have you ever bought any highly recognized product lines? Very good. Now, the next one. Okay, volunteer. Let me see in the list. Sorry, yes. the highly... yeah. Okay, who uh, say it... me? Don't say yo, say me, me. Me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, go ahead, uh, Madeline. Go ahead. Uh, have your company have any new product Okay, Observe now, wait, recently. wait, wait, Madeline, Have company, you company is plural, wait, Madeline, company, company. wait, Madeline, your company is singular or plural? I singular, um, uh -huh. has, has, has your company, has your, your company designed design any and product it, or service recently? Very good, and design is a regular verb. Yes. Okay, design is a regular verb. So, the past tense of design Designer. is, uh -huh, design, Designer. and the past tense, you add ed. Design, design. design. Okay. Very good, excellent. Let's give us an applause, please. Let's give us yes, an applause. Claps, claps, claps. claps. Okay. <laughs> claps. <laughs> okay, so we finished these exercises, but we, I want you to go to the chat. Okay? Teacher. Yes? I have a question. In, in this, when you do a question, the verb change or not? Always the verb change. Remember, oh, okay. the verb has to be in the past participle. Let me show you. Let me show you. Okay? Change Let it. me show you here. Okay, can you see here? This is a question. 
Okay, and you see lost mm -hmm. is in the past participle. Can you see here is a question as Alejandro created is in the past participle. Here, mm -hmm. have they always sold? So sold is the past participle. Here, look, use the helping verb have plus the past partic participle form. Always, oh. always. Okay? okay? That clear, Nineveh? Okay, very good. Yes. So, if you go to the chat, if you go to the chat, okay, can you upload the first the first link? These are the links that I send you by email. You remember? Yes, I remember. Okay, okay so I, I... okay, so upload the first link. So you upload this link, you give it copy, and I'm going to upload it on my internet browser okay okay so i have it right here and i'm gonna come over here and i'm going to upload it and give it okay now i'm going to share my screen so you can see it but i want you to upload it on your Computer. On your telephone or your, on your computer, because I'm going to break the, 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 the rooms, okay? So here are exercises with the present perfect. All of them are questions, okay? All of them are questions. So now remember, when we have a question like this, when we have how long, where, how much, that word goes before the auxiliary. For example, we are going to do number 10. How long? What is the meaning of how long? Hace Hace cuanto. Cuanto. Okay, so I'm going to write right here. How long? How long? Uh -huh. Has she lived? Uh -huh. What is the auxiliary? The auxiliary? Has she lived? Has, because has, has the lived. subject is she. Has she lived? Has she lived? Has she lived? She, Has she lived, lived yeah. in London. In London. Okay. How long has she lived in, in London? It's a question. So I put a question mark. Is that clear? Okay. So you check and you see how long has she lived in London? Okay. So when you have, these are called information questions because the answer the question asks for information. These are yes and no questions because the answer is yes or no. For example, if I say, have you lived in London? Have you been in London? See, sí, no. You see, the answer is yes or no. But when I say, where have you lived? A donde ha vivido? No me puede decir sí, no. You have to give me information. Is that clear? Mm, yes. yes. Okay, clear. very good. So let's do number one right here. What is number one? Aha, uh -huh, let's see. Volunteer. Aha. Uh -huh. Have you ever. No, no, have you ever. Read what? Uh -huh. No, have you ever, but have. Have you read? You, have you read? 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 Peace? Very good. Have, have you read? read? War and peace. War and peace. Okay, very good. And because it's a question, question mark. Have you read? Have you read? War and peace. Okay, very clear. Okay. Yes. Yes. Very good. Let me give it a check. And it's perfect. An applause. Okay. So, do you have this exercise in your computer or in your phone? Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay. So, I'm going to break you in groups. So, you can start doing the questions in groups. Is that clear? Yes. Hello? Okay. Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes. Very good. So I'm gonna break you right now. Okay. I'm gonna break into groups. You share in the link. The link is in the chat. It's right here. 
Okay. Okay. The link is yeah, the, okay. Thank when you. it says present perfect. Wait, Veronica. The link, chat room, where is the chat? Let me get out of here. Okay, can you see the chat right here? Can you see the chat? Yes. Okay, right here, what I have mm -hmm. highlighted is the link. That is the link that you are going to exercise right now. This link. Hey, what is the number? number it's the first one, this two, one. Three. El que está, el que está sombreado. Madre number le... four. No, no, el que está sombreado. Este. Ah, the first. The first, the first, correct. Okay, so. The second. Eh, the okay, second. so upload, okay. upload that link. Upload that link, please. Okay? Upload that link. Do you have it? Tell me when everybody is ready. Okay, so you can interact. I don't didn't found the link. The link is right here on the chat. Can you see the chat right here? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, no, no. Okay, so go ahead. Copy, copy the, the link and paste it in the Google toolbar. Paste it right there and click enter. Okay, uh, the, the most common irregular per list. No, no, that is, uh, uh, no, but this is, let me see, on the list, on the list that I gave you, yeah, let me see. The number, the, the second, the second link. No, 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 wait, 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 wait. I, I'll let you know. Okay, that is for you, uh, in, for you, questions, okay. So in, in this, in this, in this list that I'm gonna show you right now, in the, in the list that I send you, hold, hold it. In the list that I send you is this one, number is this one, number five. Ah, number five. Wow. From different. the list is number five. From the list is number five. Okay. Okay. And number five. So did you click? Yes? Do you have it? Yes. 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 Okay. Perfect English grammar. Perfect English grammar. That is correct. Very good. Very good. So I'm going to make groups right now. Okay? Okay. We are going to work in pairs. So we are 17. I'm going to make eight groups. Okay? Eight groups. Okay. Here we go. Okay, so join, join the group, please. Join, join the groups. Unase, ahí donde le dice unase, go ahead, join. Very good, Oscar. Okay, Oscar and Alicia, start practicing with your list. Daniel Perez, Rafael, join. Álvaro Rivas and Osman, very good. Eh, Blanca and Bas eh, de Vasquez and Yader, very good. Ninive and Vanessa, very good. Rafael, join. Unase, ahí donde dice join. Bessie y Cecilia. Ajá, uh -huh. what happened, Bessie? Ajá, uh -huh. very good. Cecilia, join. Cecilia, you have to join. Unase, ahí donde le dice unase, dele, ok. Cecilia. Rafael, what happened, Rafael? Rafael and Cecilia, no han entrado. Join, Cecilia. Cecilia, me escucha. Cecilia, can you turn up your microphone, please? Turn on, turn on your microphone. Cecilia, can you turn on your microphone, please? Okay, Rafael and Daniel start sharing. Cecilia.
Hello, Cecilia. Hello, Cecilia. Okay. Okay, so Bessie. I'm gonna come on here with Bessie, okay? Bessie. Hello, Bessie. Hello, Bessie. Do you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay, so go oh, to the pen. Thank you. Do you have the pen? I'm here. Yes, I have the page right over here. Okay, very good. So let's practice. Okay, number two. What is number two? She is the one that she be late for a meeting, right? Uh -huh. She be late for a meeting. Okay, she... Remember, they are late. questions. They are questions. Yeah. She have been late for a meeting. Uh -huh. No, because it's a question. The auxiliary has goes in the first position she has no has she because it's a question remember oh, i'm sorry yeah it's okay don't worry. don't worry okay go ahead so again has she be late for no, for a be, meeting be the the verb be must be in the past participle bessie so the past okay. participle of be is been yeah been. Has she been late for a meeting okay okay now, let me show you let me show you the answer can you see the answer right here? Let me see. Okay, good. Let's go to number uh -huh. three. Remember, okay. all of them are questions. Has he, like, like, has he? Exactly, has he? Has he? What is the past participle of meet? Meet, meet it. No, met. No. Met, met only with one is it e. M E A T, right? Yeah, M E T, M E T. Her family. Yet. Yet. Uh huh. Has he met your family yet? Can you I see it? Can. Can you see the answer? Has but he it's met wrong. Your family yet? Very good. Okay, number four. Show. Has he met? Right, met. With T. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. M E T. M E T. M -E -T. Has he met your family yet? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. The next one. Okay. Um have they? Have they? Um lived uh, is a lived. Uh -huh. lived only uh -huh. hey, he perfect. Did. Very good, Bessie. Live here as long as we have exactly have they lived here as long as we have perfect oh, very good let me see next okay um have you have you have you have you is going to be in past gone past, right past participle uh -huh. what is the past participle of go gone gone very good Desi. To Austra Australia. Have you gone to Australia? Very good. Let me check. That is correct. Uh huh. And Cecilia has an enter, huh? Where is Cecilia? Okay, very good. Number six. <laughs> Number six. <laughs> has she? Uh huh. Miss is Miss also it. a regular verb. Uh huh. So you Miss add. Miss the bus. Ed. You add ed. ed. Uh -huh. For example, here I'm gonna put the answer for uh, question number four. Can you see it? Four. Have they lived? Have they lived here as long as we have? Can you see it? Uh, no, number teacher. Four. I'm number looking four. at. It's right here. Look. Can you see it? That is mm. the answer. Of question number four. Qu no. But. Uh -huh. Where? Number five, Where? number five is right here. Have you gone to Australia? Uh huh. That's correct. Okay. Now number five. Okay. Now number six. How is number six? 
I say, has she missed the bus? Uh -huh. Pronunciation, missed, missed. with T, missed. With has she missed the missed. bus? Yes, that's correct. Okay, has she missed the bus? So you see, show the answer. Mm -hmm. Has she missed the bus? Okay, number seven. Um, number seven, have I met? Uh-huh. Have I met you before? Excellent. You see, have I met uh -huh. you before? Very good. The Let next see. one, number eight. Let me see. Check. That's correct. Um, have they take the exam? Okay. Now, what is the past participle of take? The, the, isn't it the is take, took, taken? Yes. Exactly. Very good. Very good, Bessie. So, go ahead. So, take, what is it? What is the question? Have they take, take, take the exam? Taken the exam. Taken, uh huh. Taken the exam. Very good. Let Have me they see. taken the exam? Excellent. Okay. Let's go with number nine. Number nine. She work. Okay, this is easy. Has she uh -huh. work? Work. Pronunciation like, uh -huh. with T. Work. Work. In this. In this company for 15 years. 15 years. Okay, excellent. Can you see the answer? Very good. Let me see. Let me check. Okay. okay you check. No problem. Okay. Okay. Now, 11. Number, number 10. Eight. You see number 10? I already did. You remember the example? Mm. How long has she lived? In no, London. I am a number 10, but you tell me that. <laughs> but okay. do it, but you do it. Okay, go ahead, do it. It's okay. Uh, okay. So how long is the double H question? How long yeah. is, una, is una palabra que pregunta información, así como donde, como, cuando, okay? Mm -hmm. They always okay. go in the first position. Mm -hmm. so how long... Mm -hmm. How long uh -huh. she has? No, because it's a question. How has long she? has she? That's has correct. she? Has she? Uh -huh. Has she lived Live in London? In London. That is correct. Very good. Very good. In London. Okay. Now, let's go to number 11. But it tell me that it's wrong. Why? Ah, probably How because long? You, didn't put, you didn't put the question mark. How long has no, she lived? I do it. How long has she lived? Um, um, so and I'm right over here. Ask, can, you see the, no. can you see the answer? I have the problem right over here in the birth. Live? Ah. I have to, I have to put it in to the past. the past participle. That is correct. Okay. okay, very good that you are looking where you have making a mistake, right? Okay. Yeah. Number 11. Uh, number 11. Where, where have you, where have you, uh, this is in past, been, right? Hey, excellent, Bessie, very good. Where have you been? Excellent. Let me check. Okay, okay very good. Number Let 12. See how much coffee you drink today? And no, no. this one. How much? I, I am number 12. Yeah, okay. I'm number 12. How much coffee? How much coffee have you, in the birth in the past, have you, how much coffee have you drunk? Uh -huh. Have you drunk? With you instead of the I is uh -huh. D R U N K. Drunk. How much coffee? How much? Uh, let me see. How much coffee? Have, Have you, you drunk? 
drunk. D-R-U-N-K. Today. Today. Let me see if that's correct. Okay, yeah. very good. Very good. Now, you may continue this at home, okay? Okay. We are going to come back because we need more things to do, okay? Okay. 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 Very Let's good. Excellent work, okay? Congratulations. Uh, thanks for your help. <laughs> Congratulations. Thanks for your help. Very good. Very good. Okay, thank okay, you. Okay, guys. We are going to come back. Hello, teacher. Teacher, we can hear you. You are. Okay, how was your practice? Teacher, a few times. We need more time, teacher. I know, yes. but we need more time. It's difficult. Now, so what we do? Oh, okay. What's, okay, what's suggestions, interesting? Suggestions. This is what we're going to do. You see, you go into the links at home. Okay, the ones that you okay. say, ah, I don't know what is the answer here, mark it. And then the next day, we get into the link and we clear. Okay. Clear you, okay. okay? Okay, because okay. I can practice with you. <laughs> Remember that this was yesterday's topic, okay? This was yesterday's topic. Oh, teacher, but I need my yes. more time. Yeah, okay, but tomorrow we will practice more, okay? But okay. you go and practice okay. with the links at home, okay? Okay, okay. very good. Okay, okay. excellent. Now, Let's see what is the agenda for today. You see, this is only a review, okay? Now, the, review, the agenda for today, uh -oh. okay, the agenda for today is this, okay? Uh, <laughs> let me call, ooh, man, I need time. Yeah, you need more time, yeah. and I also need more time. So we can check on this, okay? Okay. Now, can you see what is on the board? Not yet. I see you in the space. In the space. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the color blue. In the background. So you see, your, I'm an alien. I'm an alien. Are, okay. Now, see? this is the topic for today. Ah, no, not this one. This. <laughs> I see you blue, teacher. <laughs> I know. I know it's, it's the background, okay? So here, this is the agenda for today. As you know, we are in INSA 4, uh, English Corporativo, right? Intermediate 2, Model 2, Facilitator, my name. And we are in Unit 1, Product Development. Remember, what is your collaboration? Attendance. Must attend sessions every day. Attends will, attendance will be taken twice in a minute. And you should have your camera on when saying present. And the students must say verbally present. Okay? Now, platform completion. You have to do the task and should be done daily. Weekly task completion grade will be uploaded on the end. Okay, like Fridays. So you need to do your task. I will show you. A student should participate on the forum after every session. You have until the previous class to participate. Let me show you that real quick, okay? <coughs> Sorry. Okay, so. Okay, we are right here. This is the platform. You remember? 
Yes. Platform? Yes. Okay, yes. so I'm going to go to course. As you can see, I have completed all the tasks. Like, I don't know if it was Oscar who completed all the tasks already. I'm checking, I'm checking. Okay, so you go to section number one. Section number one and you click right here. Unit one product uh, development, okay? So that is okay. the first section. So you click right here and we have video conference one. So you yes. see for the first class, we have one homework. So you have to click right here on the homework and do the homework, okay? Yes. So, now, remember, this is the third class. So you see, I am in the homework. So this is, for example, I'm gonna put only that. This is the homework. Once the idea has been completed, the product must be taken to a location where you can get it. What is that? Idea generation or commercialization? So you have to click. Commercialization. I know, okay, so you I... click that. Is that clear? So yes. that is for, yes, the first, for the yes. first session, okay? So you have to do your homework today, okay? Oh. Well, tomorrow. That is homework number one. If you go to the previous, here, okay? Okay. Teacher. Yes. This is on the platform. But but there the, there are a problem. Oh, there is a problem with the videos. Videos. Uh huh. What happened with the video? Uh, it's repeat the first video in the all in the other videos. Really? Yes, I am in the. 1.6, but I can pass yes. because the video is not correct. The first video it's talk okay. about it's, the press, the introduction yourself. Uh -huh, it's ah, again, so, again, again. Ah, okay. So I'm gonna tell the the support team to to change the video. They uploaded the same video. Okay. Mm -hmm. So yes. Okay. Very good. Very good. That is good. Okay. That that you tell me. So you click on section one and product development then you go you see this is yesterday's class this is yesterday's class so you have to do the homework you see the homeworks are okay. very easy five questions yes yes okay so you do the homework right here okay this is homework 1.3 linsay linsay has or is or have so obviously has. It is has. 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 has okay so you have to select remember this is all about present perfect so using has and have is that clear so this is the, yes. the second homework very good now continuing you go to section one again okay section one you click right here and then this is today's class. This is today's class. There is a homework. Okay. After I check the attendance, we have to follow the homework. Is that clear? So you click right here and yes. you do the homework. We have three exercises. Yeah, but this is for tomorrow, okay? Because this is what I'm going to teach today. Okay? Okay, so here. So you go and do the same. There are five questions, only five questions. Okay, now at the end, at the end, there's a discussion. Okay, for example, I am in the homework. And look, you have to participate here. Section number one, number one, video. You see, this is where the video is, right? Okay, so you come over here and you see there is the video and there's a discussion right here. There's a discussion. What is the discussion? What did you already know about product development? Where did you learn it? What was interesting for you about the product development process and why? 
So you go and following and you write your comments. Is that clear? Your opinion. Okay. You answer those yes. questions and you give your opinions. Okay? okay. Are we clear? Okay. Okay, yeah. very good. Sure. So that is... We have to write. We have to write the description. Yeah, you have to write the answers and explain. Okay, remember, explain, this is about but, uh -huh. participating. Okay, now, that was okay. class number one. Okay, All this right. is the so, video, number one, okay? Now, we're gonna go to course again, and we're gonna go to video class number two, okay? Yesterday's class, this was Monday's class. Okay, so we go to section one again, product development, and we go to, to the second, okay? So you have to click on the second one. Let's see if the video is the same. You see, the video is right here. No, this is a different class. Look, this was yesterday's class. The video is about yesterday's class. Can you see what I did? Yes, okay, yes. very good. Yes. The, the same yes. thing. There's a discussion. What is the discussion? Tell me at least five things that you have done. So you're gonna say, hey, I have eaten pupusas. I have cleaned my house. Uh, my mother has listened to music. Uh, my husband or my wife has taken a bath. Is that clear? So you have to write five things about the things that you have. Look at the example. Only work. Okay. I have five, 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 five things. Look, I have five. cleaned my house. I have done have my done English my class. English. I have I told have you come. what I have done this week. Oh, this week. Is that clear? So five sentences. So the video is right here. This is yesterday class. Okay? Okay. And okay. the same thing. I'm going to do it once again. I'm going to go to course. Section one, because all this week is section one, unit product de development. And now I'm going to go to uh, number three here. You see video conference number three. That is today. That is today. So you click right here. Obviously, there's no video. And you go to discussion. I will play, I will put the discussion point tomorrow. Is that clear? Okay. Yeah. So the discussion, you see, I haven't posted the discussion. I will post it tomorrow, early tomorrow. Is that clear? So you have, you read yes. what I want you to do and you give me your opinion. Okay. Is that clear? Okay. Very okay. good. Okay. Let me see. Okay, now this is today's topics. Okay, as you, I was explaining you. Okay, so video conference number three, how to use adverb clauses, how to reduce, okay? How to reduce adverb clauses of time, okay? And the agenda, introduce the topic, ask and answer introduction questions. We are going to do that tomorrow. We're gonna go here, introduce how to reduce adverb clauses of time and practice reducing adverb clauses of time. Okay, so now that that is clear, I'm gonna check attendance, okay? Okay, let me see, Yader. Yader, Edermer, Mejia, Batres. Remember, turn your... Uh, turn your... Okay, so you don't want me blue, right? You want me like that. <laughs> okay, so Yader, Yader, Edermer, Mejia, Present, turn your microphones. Yader, Yader is not here. Blanca Estela. Present. Very good, thank you. Maria Eugenia. 
María Eugenia Cruz de Magaña. Teacher, Javier Mejía, I am here. Ah, ok. Excellent. Very good. Ok, uh, María Eugenia Cruz. Absent. Ok, vamos a ver. Bessie Anayensi. Jovel. Bessie. Sorry, teacher. Eugenia is present. Ah, Eugenia is present. Ok, no problem. Eh, Bessie. Bessie. Bessie was practicing with me. Where is Bessie? Your microphone. Turn your microphone on, please. Bessie. Present. Teacher, ah, okay. present. Very good. Oscar Eduardo Majano. Present. Very good. Raúl okay. Mauricio Rivera Saldívar. Present. Okay, thank you. Nínive, Saraí. Present. Very good. Marta Beatriz Alegría, Barahona. Present. Very good. Álvaro Enrique Rivas, Ángel. Present, teacher. Hello, present. Present, teacher. Ah, okay. I can hear... I can barely hear you. Okay, next, uh, Rafael René Molina. Present, sir. Thank you. Maria Thank you. Adelina Araya Menendez. Present, present. Thank you very much. Alicia Carolina Lopez. Present. Okay, very good. Present. Osman Enrique Hernandez. Present, sir. Very good. Thank you. Cecilia Yamilet Fuentes. Present. Okay, Cecilia, where were you in the practice? Okay. I'm here. I'm listening. Okay. Uh, eh, Cecilia, when I break the rooms, le va a aparecer ahí que usted tiene que unirse. Entonces se une para, para hacer la, los trabajos en pareja. Okay? Yeah. Okay, very good. Daniel Osvaldo. Present. Very good. Thank you. Verónica Beatriz. Uh, present. present. Ok, very good. Ana del Carmen Cortés. Andre, Andrés, Ale, Andrea Alexandra Flores Chacón. Kenia Johanna Pérez Pérez. Vanessa Ale, Alexandra Armas Rosales. Present. Okay, very good, very good. Okay, now that that is done. Bueno. Okay, very good. So, now that we saw this, let's go and talk about how to reduce arbitrary clauses. Okay, I'm going to show you a video. Okay, I'm going to show you a video about, no, it's not here, it's here. Okay, so watch this video, please, okay? I'm gonna... Uh, okay, I'm gonna share my screen first, okay? Okay, here we go, watch this video. Watch this video, please, okay? So to reduce this adverb clause of time, we need a time word and a present participle. That's the ing form of the sentence. Look at this example. Okay, it says that we need a time word. What is the time word? After. That is a time word. Una palabra de tiempo, so una, so a, a, a time word is after, it shows you before is a time word. And we need the present participle. The present participle is the verb with ing. Is that clear? Like for example, okay. the verb is fall. So the present participle will be falling. So this is, 
no puedes ir a mover el pelo. Ok, so this Estoy en clase, mami, ahorita. Ok, here we go. reduce can you see we have two clauses this is an independent clause because i began to to have a strange dream it is understood it explained itself now this is a clause dependent clause because if i say after i fell asleep so what happened okay it's not complete so this one is dependent they it depends of another clause to have meaning para tener sentido okay so what it says if you want to reduce this doing this one condition the subject as you can see the subject is i the subject of the first clause has to be the same subject of the second clause is that clear yes yes so first condition yes. Okay, first condition, the subject of the two clauses has to be the same. Okay? Okay, okay very good. That's why we can change it. And how do we change it? We put a time word after and then follow. Now, it has to make sense right here. For example, let me show you here. After the time work is right here, so I use the time work. I don't write the subject anymore. That is that, that's what is called reducing. Por eso es que se le llama reduciendo, because I don't use the subject of the two sentences. No, I reduce it. So I use now I use the same verb, but in the present participle. So after falling. You remember the present is fall. The simple past is fail. So after falling asleep, and the second clause is the same. I began to have a strange dream. Is that clear? Yes. Yes. yes? Okay. Very good. I, I write it. Okay. Very Always. good. Now so let's, let's continue. That's why we can use this phrase. Okay, she is asking, can we reduce, can we reduce this, this adverb clause? What is the condition? You remember the condition? After. No, you remember, what is the, what was the condition? The condition is that the subject right here, the subject right here, has to be the same, the same in the second as right here. So you see here, we have different subjects. So she asks a question. Can we reduce this adverb clause? No. No, we can't. Why not? Because, because the subject, this subject is different, different from this subject. Is that clear? So listen to the explanation. Clear. No. No. Subjects are different. Subjects are different. Can you see? They. Here's how you make an adverb clause phrase. First, remove the subject in the adverb clause. Okay, so number one, you don't write the subject in the adverb clause that you reduce. Right? The subject in the in the adverb clause. You don't use the subject anymore. Very good. Look over here. 
Can you? And make any necessary changes to the subject in the main clause so the sentence makes sense. Okay, now, here, she's talking about two children. The subject is two children, and she, and here, in in the independent clause, they refers to the two children. So the subject is the same, okay? So, we don't use the subject anymore. We put while, and you see, the verb is a slip. It's in the past. The base form is a slip. And the present participle with ing is a sleeping. So I say sleeping. while a sleeping, while I don't sleeping. use the subject anymore, soundly in their bed. But here, when I say they, who? So I need the subject. So I put the subject right here. Two children dream of dragon. Do you understand? Yes. 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 Vaya. Uh, ¿Y por qué? Esto yes. lo voy a decir en español. ¿Y por qué pongo aquí two children? Porque Because cuando it's digo, day. ajá, sí, porque este day no me explica de quién es el sujeto. No es muy explícito. Entonces, I use the subject that is here, here, so the, so it is clear that I'm talking about the two children. Is that clear? Okay. Yes. Okay. Very good. Let's yes. continue. Teacher. Yes. It's only what it's mean. Huh? It's only. The word only. Ah, the word only. Uh -huh. Yes. What is uh -huh. the meaning? Sa what is the meaning? Is like uh, with a, uh, a con sonido, sin sonido. While they oh, were okay. sleeping soundly, cuando estaban durmiendo, like placenteramente in their beds. Is that clear? Yes. Ok. Entonces, mientras los dos niños dormían placenteramente en sus camas, they dreamed. Ellos soñaron de dragones, fast scooters. Usted sabe que es un scooter. You know what is a scooter, right? Yes. Yeah, those uh, three, yes. like a, it's like a skateboard well, with a handle. Okay. Yes, yes. Scooters and other thrills. Okay, very good. So that's how you reduce. Now watch, watch how they reduce it. Second, remove any helping verbs in the adverb clause. Okay, All right. number two. If you have, like in this case, you don't have a helping verb. Helping verb so are all the auxiliaries. So if you have an auxiliary, they say remove any hel helping verbs. Is that clear? For example, if I have here, while they were sleeping, so I'm not going to use where, because where is an auxiliary. I'm going to use while sleeping. sleeping. Exactly. Yes. Okay, very good, very good. Mm -hmm. Three, focus on the main verb. Use the present participle. And remember, with that present participle, you're expressing an active meaning. Okay, and number three, look at the main verb and you need the present participle. The present participle is a sleeping, right? Present participle, all the verbs are on a base form plus ing, okay? ing, running, uh, drinking, watching, dancing, eating. Yes, okay, that is ing. The participle. Okay, very I good. Yes. And our last step, keep the time word if it's necessary. We don't always use a time word when we shorten an adverb clause of time. While is often omitted because it's understood. Okay, it says while this, this often. word can be often omitted. Omitted. But it's not necessary. It's not necessary. So you always use it, but it can be omitted. Hopefully you understand how I wrote this sentence in the story. 
sleeping soundly in their beds, two children dreamed of dragons, fast scooters, and other thrills. Okay, so you see, they reduce it. They don't use while, they use the verb in the ing form, sleepily sound in their bed. Now here it says they, but they doesn't exactly show who. So it's better to use the subject, that subject. Two children dream of dragons, fast scooters, and other thrills. And that is called an advert clause reduction. Okay? Reduction. Let me point out that the full adverb clause could be written a different way. After a while, there could be a progressive verb. While two children were sleeping soundly in their bed. That makes sense too. Again, the process would be the same. We remove any help from her. Okay, you see, they remember the helping verb? This is the helping verb. The two children were sleeping. So they say, you remove this and you remove the subject. And also, because it's wild, wild can be omitted. So you can reduce this like this. Sleepily, soundly in their beds, two children dream of dragons. And our main verb is already a present participle. So this makes our job easier. When we change adverb clauses with progressive verbs, just take out the form of be and keep the present participle. You understand that? When we are working with progressive, sure. with progressive tenses, we keep the verb exactly as it is because it's in the present participle and we only uh, omit and we only uh, take out the helping verb and the subject. Yes, ask me. Mm -hmm. It's the same. It's the same. It's the same. To it's write the, the long, the long phrase or short. It's the same. Exactly. That's what is called reduction. Only in conversation, teacher. In conversation, it's better to short or when I write it long. No. In no. conversation, it's better to use the long form, but in oh. writing, in writing, it's better to reduce. Okay, that's oh, why we teach you. this. Uh huh. And yeah. you will see this very often when they send emails. People oh, usually okay. reduce. Remember, people that speak English are very uh, practical, so they want to yes. reduce things. Okay, not make it complicated. Okay, so that's why they use reduction. That's why yes, we understand. teach this, because mm -hmm. in emails, you use it a lot, okay? In, in, in written conversation. Okay, let's continue. It's very easy. I mentioned that we often omit while when we create these phrases. We sometimes omit when, too. I did this in the story. Look at this example. Realizing what had just happened, they began to laugh. When? Okay, so this is the, the, the other clause. When they realize what had just happened, they began to laugh. Now, look at the subject. What is the subject here? They. They. And what they. is the subject they. here? They. Uh -huh. they. So that means it makes the condition. So I can reduce it. Now, can you see what is the main verb right here? Realize. Yes. Realize. Realize. So I have Realize. to make it. Uh -huh. I have Realizing. to make it present participle. Uh -huh. Realize it. So you see? I use all this and I use ing. Uh, realizing. You understand what is the meaning realizing. of realizing? Yes. yes. Realizing is darse cuenta. So, dándose cuenta que había pasado, que había pasado, ellos comenzaron a reírse. Is that clear? Yes. Yes. yes? Very yes. good. Yes. Very good. My story isn't very formal. But in more formal English, I could have written, 
upon realizing what had just happened. Upon is a time word that has the meaning of when. So that is optional, using upon is optional. Makes it more formal. Let's talk for a moment about word order. These phrases that act like adverbs are usually in an initial position at the beginning of a sentence, but they can also be in a final position. Let's look at some examples. Okay, do you understand that? For example, yes. the, adverb, the adverb clause, we have seen that they are in at the beginning. And then the main clause is following, but they can also be in a different order. First the main clause and then the phrase, okay? Here are two lines from the story. Seeing the umbrella right over his head, the husband jumped and raised his arm. Realizing what had just happened, they began to laugh. In both sentences, the phrase comes before the main clause. Okay, so you see in blue is, is the adverb clause that is reduced to a phrase. Okay, in both at the beginning. Now, take a look. Commas are generally used for separation. Very important. When they come at the beginning, we need a comma to separate the two clauses. Is that clear? Oh, yes. So be, right. be careful, okay? Write so, a comma. Uh -huh. So be careful because this is probably can come in the midterm, in the, in the exercises, okay? Mm -hmm. Okay, very good. Next. Now compare those examples to these. I have two more lines from the story. As usual, she had read a couple chapters from a novel before going to sleep. She took a few steps toward the family room, grabbing a long umbrella on her way. Okay, now, can you see that they switch the order of the clauses? Now, the main clause is at the beginning. And following the clause is the adverb clause. Can you see no comma is necessary? Can you see it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Now, yes. the second example, she took a few steps toward the family room. And here, you can see that no comma is necessary. Uh, you see? It, it, comma. It's grabbing a long umbrella on her way. So, listen to the explanation. In these two sentences, the phrase comes after. Commas aren't always used for separation in this case. In the first sentence, I chose not to use a comma. The phrase is quite short. In the second, we have a longer phrase. Most writers would use a comma here. It helps the reader to separate the two ideas. Is that clear? When the, when the phrase is short, no comma is necessary. But when oh, the yes. phrase is long, it's better to put a comma so you can identify the two sentences. Is that clear? When I write, when yeah. I write at, at, at first. Yeah, you can say. I to write the, the comma. Yeah, of, of course. You can, but with capital G, grabbing a long umbrella on her way, comma, she took a few steps toward the family room. Mm -hmm. Or like here, with capital B, before going to sleep, as you, comma, as usual, she had read a couple chapters from a novel. Is that clear? Teacher. Yes. yes. Okay. Teacher. Yes. In this example, if we put a comma, um, it's okay or it's a wrong? Uh, it's not that it's wrong. They recommend that if the phrase is short, if the phrase is short, no, don't write a comma. Okay. But if the phrase is long, like she said, write the comma. Because okay. you can see the separation of the two clauses with the comma. 
Okay. Because when it's long, you can make, you can be confused. Hey, which is the main clause and which is the phrase? Do you understand? Yes. But when it's really short, you can see, ah, the phrase is this one. Look, very short. Okay? Okay, let's okay. continue. I'd like you to try a very short exercise to test your understanding. Change the phrases back into full adverb clauses. I'll give you three sentences. One, as usual, she had read a couple chapters from a novel before going to sleep. The full adverb clause is before she went to sleep. Okay, do you understand? As usual, she. If you are going to make it a long adverb, remember you have to write the subject. So the subject will be she. And in this case, because it's in the past, you will use the past of the verb go, which is when. Went to the past of go. Uh, exactly. Okay, very good. right over his head the husband jumped and raised his arms okay what is the subject the subject is it no umbrella no oh huh? the subject She's is the husband the husband, the husband. I, okay. I can i can i can read because <laughs> so you can say um, right here while while the husband so the umbrella, you remember the past tense? Let's mm -hmm. take a look. The full adverb clause would be when the husband saw the umbrella right over his head. Then we change the subject in the main clause to a pronoun, he. Okay, is that clear? Three. Yes. After no. Yes. Are you sure? Remember, what is yes. the subject? The husband. The husband. Okay. okay, so we can say here, when the husband or what the husband, because there are two past actions. So the umbrella right the over. The husband saw the umbrella yes. and saw, because the verb is see. See the, the umbrella. is saw. Okay, very good. Last exercise. Enjoyed having no more interruptions. Okay, so in this case, after who? After the husband and wife. Uh huh. After the, the husband, husband and wife. Fall. In the past. Fell. Fell asleep. Fell asleep. Fell asleep. A second time. A the second husband time. and wife enjoy having. Okay, okay, very good. You are very good. They having no more okay. Uh -huh. They no had no more interaction. Okay, very good. So now we're gonna go to the book real quick. Okay, and we are going to do some exercises. Okay, here we go. Uh, where is the book? Is right here. Okay. So go to page page fifteen. Adverb clauses. Uh oh. What did I? I didn't do something here. Uh -huh, right here. Okay. So, okay. What is on your screen? The book? Yes, yes. right? Okay. So, I want you to read this carefully. And if you have any questions, you ask me. No, let's let's do it together. How to use reduce adverb clauses of time? 
Look at the examples in the box, then complete the exercises below. Okay, let's take a look at the first exercise. Adverb clauses introduced by before, after, since, and while can be reduced while. To, mo to modifying while. adverb phrases. Okay, so this is the adverb clause. After we conduct a SWOT analysis, we will know whether to go or to go on or stop with this project. With this project. Okay, again, number one condition. Remember, number one condition, the subject. The subject has to be the same. The same we subject. We and we. So we can make the reduction. So we say after conducting is that clear hello yes yes it's the same, okay, so it's after same we. yes yes teacher yes. a SWOT analysis and the rest is the same we will know whether to go on or stop with this project okay so the same rules to reduce an adverb clause to a phrase do the following number one Eliminate the subject in the other clause. If the clause has a form of the verb be or helping verb, eliminate it. And if the clause has any other verb different from be, add ing. Okay? Now, ing. The reduction is only possible when the subject. The reduction is. Of the other clouds and the independent clouds are the same. Are the same. Are the same. That clear? Only. That is number yes. one condition. Okay, so number two. Before we make a decision, we still need to go over the opportunities and threat that could affect the company. So, can we make the reduction? Yes. yes or no? Yes. 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 Why yes? What is the subject right here? We. We. What we. is the subject right here? We. 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 So we yes, we decision. can make the reduction. Okay. So very easy. Before making, can you see? Before we eliminate the subject mm -hmm. and we add to the verb ing. Making. Making. Or making a decision. We still yeah, have to go over the, the opportunities and threats that could affect the company. Is that clear? Will affect the yes. company. Yes, it's yes. Okay. okay. Very, very good. Easy. Very good. Now let's go to exercise three A. Before the new product new project product gets, gets a green gets light, we still yes, need still to be the, the, the threats yeah. from outside. Can we make the advert reduction? No. No, because right. the subject is not the same. Uh -huh. What is the subject? It's on the line right it's here. It's it. the new product it. is the subject. Okay, the new product yeah. is the subject. And yes. what is the subject right here? We. 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 Are they we. the same it's subject? Different. It's different. It's different. It's different. So, they are different. Uh -huh. Before a getting a green light, we still need to be the threat from outside? Not possible. No, that no X, it's not possible. Uh -huh. That X means no way. Why? No way. Why? Because the... Here, the uh, subject... The it's not subject in a bird close. And the independent clouds are, are, are different. Are different. So the reduction, uh, so the reduction should not be done. done. Okay. Now should not be done. Okay. Very good. Now we are going. You are going to make first. You are going to decide if we can make a reduction or not. And if we if we can make the reduction, we are going to do it. Okay. We, you yes. are going to do number one with me and two, three, four, five, and six. You are going to do it in pairs. Okay, in pairs. Okay. I want you to work number one is, is okay. Huh? So. And number one is okay. Eat it. Ah, 
The product okay, it. Okay, very it, good. It. So the subject here is it. the product development team. Development. Oh, this is the subject. Yes. The product it's development. It. The team. other. Uh huh. It. About the product. Are you sure it's the same? Yes. Yes, I'm sure. Because it. Uh -huh. it okay, very good. It, development. So how will be, how will, how it will be the reduction? Uh, fini finishing brain terming. Uh -huh. After, after. Uh, so we use uh, after finishing brainstorming the product that they developed. It is essential to discard ideas. ideas that are not feasible. Questions about vocabulary. What is the meaning of feasible? Feasible, feasible. is factibly. Factibly. Feasible. Is that clear? What is yes. feasible? Feasible is factibly. Okay. Feasibility. 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 Okay. Is that clear? Number two is okay. Number okay, two wait, is okay wait, wait. because number two, you are going to do it in pairs, okay? Oh, okay. in pairs. <laughs> it's okay. Okay. The okay, so we're gonna go in groups, okay? In groups. Yeah, in okay. pairs. I'm sorry, in pairs, okay? In pairs with. Okay, here we go. The same, the same pairs. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm gonna go with uh, with Bessie because Cecilia left. Okay, let me see, Alvaro. Yes, sir. Okay, so you're gonna move to number one. Did you hear me, teacher? Okay, mover a number one. Okay, with Bessie. Okay, so now we have everybody's pair. Okay, start working, please. Okay, work in pairs. In pairs. In pairs. Okay, here we, we are go. Three. Now join. Join. Okay, join. Join, join, join. So you start working in pairs. Join, please. Okay, join. Ah, Andrea. Andrea no ha entrado. Hello, Andrea. ¿A qué hora entró, Andrea? Okay, Andrea. Let me see. Cecilia. Hello, good evening. Good evening, Eugenia Magaña. Vaya, okay. Excelente, excelente. Y Cecilia. Okay, so, okay, so you're gonna be group number, okay, go to group number one, okay, Andrea, join. Cecilia, Cecilia, are you there? Eugenia? Hello. Yes. Cecilia? Hello. Cecilia? Hello. Eugenia? Hello, I'm here. Okay, Eugenia, you're gonna go with group number two. Uh, Raul Rivera, you're gonna go with group number three. Okay, join. Jader, you're gonna go with group number four. Okay, Cecilia. Hello. Cecilia, you're gonna go with group Hello. number one, Cecilia. So remember, you do the exercises. You're gonna first. You're gonna decide if you can reduce or not. 
Okay. 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 Then we have to write, teacher. Ah, yes. only... You don't have a group. You don't have yes. a group, Veronica. No, no, no. I have a, a question. What uh, is your question? We have to write or only discuss? The no. Talk. First, you're going to discuss if it is possible to make the reduction. Okay. Okay? You okay. remember, if the subject is the same, it is possible. If it is possible, okay. make, make the okay. reduction. Okay? Yes. Okay. And okay. number two, I can. Because okay. the manager is a he. Okay. Yeah, I, I have he is the same. I uh, listening the witness of the company on a slide L and manager has presented. Okay, hold on, hold on, Madeline. Listing, listing, listing. Uh -huh. oh, it's with capital listing. L before okay. and you need before. Remember, you can omit yes. only the two words when and while. Yes. The yes. other ones you cannot omit. You can omit only okay. when okay. and while, if you want. Okay? I told you don't omit Please them. Stand the weakness. No, but you need before. Because you see, when you have words such as after and before, you need to write them down. Only when you have while and when, you can omit them. Is that clear? For example, here. Okay, yes. yes. Okay, after Listen. after Listen. finishing, you need to use after. After finishing. Right? Number two, before listing. Okay, go ahead. Work together. I'm gonna get out and I'm gonna go to the other groups. Mm -hmm. Okay. In right. which number? In which number are you? Number, number two. You are with Veronica, right? Madeline and Veronica. You are together. Start working yes. together, please. Okay? Yes, okay. together. We have, okay. Yeah, we work continue. together. Please. And number Cecilia, three. Cecilia, A what is your A group, Cecilia? Go to number two, Cecilia. Cecilia, join, join. Unase. Cecilia, sure you're here. <laughs> Cecilia, únase al grupo número tres. Join. No ha entrado. Aquí aparece. No ha entrado. She writes alone. Okay, number three. Number three, Andy. join. Solo póngale unirse. Ahí donde Andrew, unirse, usted le pone unirse. Yes. Andrew is a man. Yes. And he is a man, and yes, is uh, I can, I can reduce, reduce. Andrew and the keeping text missing in miss. Oh, I don't know what is keeping. Cecilia, me escucha, Cecilia. Messaging, 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 Mas, messaging, messaging. 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 Keeping text messaging while Andrew uh -huh. was it a has to be. No, because this is Andrew kept text messaging about the prototype messaging. for a new product. So, here, you see, this is the prototype. Here, here is the, here it's is okay. the texting. This texting is the, the messaging. No, Andrew kept text messaging while. While being, while being in a video conference. Remember, this is the verb to be. Okay. In the present, right? Plus ing, yes. being. So while being in a video conference. Okay? okay? Ah, being. Ah, yes. It's yes. another clause. Yeah, another clause. Texting mm -hmm. mess messaging while uh, Andrew has has been uh -huh. yes. has yes. been in a video conference about the prototype uh -huh, for new product. Yes, uh, good. Yes. It's reduced. Uh -huh. And number four, uh, 
promising product ideas. Um, no, the other, no. I don't, I don't see the other, okay. the other. No, um, no, I think it's different, uh-huh. That is different, uh -huh. number four is different. Yes. Number five, uh, okay. it's I different. Wanna... Hey, guys. Uh, okay. Okay. So, <laughs> Hello, how are you? Hello, yeah. Good. And you? Good. Do you have any questions? Yeah. Hello. We are trying to develop. Okay. Yes. Okay. What to the question? <laughs> which one are Which one are you doing? What number? We're trying to develop number two, I think. Number two. So first, is the subject, the manager, the same as he? Yes. Is the subject the same? Yes. 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 We can make the reduction. Okay, so we need before. Remember, we can only omit while and when. So we need before. Before, what is the mm -hmm. verb? The verb is right here, listed. Listen. Uh -huh. It's in the past. So we need it in the present participle. The present participle will be listing. Listening. So before mm -hmm. listing yeah, yeah. the weaknesses of the company on a slide, he had presented new products to help the company increase sales. You see, very easy. Is that clear? Mm -hmm. That is easy. The other ones. Before listing, can you see? Before listing the weaknesses of the company on the slide, he had presented new products to the... Okay, do the other ones. I'm going to another group. Bye-bye. Okay, bye. Thank you. <laughs> bye. 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 <laughs> Let's see number three. Andrew, it's the subject. Sales quedó before, uh, before presenting a new before presenting a new a new idea to the manager. You need to, you present. Need to present. Okay. Uh, teacher, we have a question. Uh huh. What is your question? Let me see. That's why I am here to help you with the third one the third one okay first the first thing we we are we we think that we can change what what is the subject the same uh -huh. uh, what is the subject yes. okay uh, who am i yes, who andrew, am i here andrew. with andrew and he it's the same subject uh-huh the manager and he is the same subject so we can make the request Okay, so it will be, yes. Yes. it will be, this word, you need this word. The only one that you can omit is while and when. Do you remember? But this one, you have to use it. So you're going to use it before, what is the verb? Keep. No, Keep. it's number two, right? Ah, uh, was. No, it's the, the three. No. Ah, oh, number the three. The third, yes. Ah, the third yeah. one. Okay, wait. Andrew kept text messenger. Andrew is the subject, right? Yes. And, yes. and in a video conference about the prototype for the new product. What are he? He is the subject. Yes. Okay. So, Andrew. We that we can reduce. No, remember, now, look. This is the adverb clause. This is the adverb clause. Why? So is it? Because he has while. Yes. Okay, so this one, the same. Andrew kept text messaging while, you can omit this, but uh -huh. we're gonna use it. While being, what is the verb? Uh, was. was. Uh -huh. And what is the base form of was? Is be. You remember? Be. Uh 
The uh -huh. base form is B. Uh -huh. And you add ing, being. So while being in a video conference. I can. Okay. Okay. And the answer is Andrew kept, kept test messaging while, while? he's being. No, while, remember, we, we don't use mm. the subject anymore. Okay, okay. Only the okay. verb, which is base form B plus ING. So, while being, okay. while being in a video. Ah, okay. Conference. That clear? Ah, okay. Okay, okay. very good. Yes. Very good. Okay. Now, I, I have to check list. So, I'm going to break the, the groups again, okay? Okay. okay. I know Thanks. it's very little Thanks, time, Tom. but uh, but I need to check this. Okay. 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 Very good. Very good. Teacher, your microphone is off. Every time that I come back from the groups, the microphone the microphone is off. Okay, let's see. Yader, Yader, Yader is right there. Hello, present. Turn on your phone. Turn on your present. Okay, thank you. Present. Uh, present. Thank you, present. Okay, present. Very good. Very good. Maria Eugenia Cruz. Present. Okay, very good. Bessie. And Present. Okay, very good. Oscar Eduardo Majano. Present. Okay, very good. Raul Mauricio Rivera. Present. Okay, very good. Ninive. Present. Very good. Eh, Marta Beatriz Alegría. Marta, Beatriz, Alegría. Present. Okay, thank you. Álvaro Enrique Rivas. Álvaro. Present, I can hear you, okay. Rafael, Molina. Rafael, René Molina. Present, 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 teacher. Thank present, you, Rafael. teacher. Thank you. Maria Adelina Araya. Marina, your microphone. Turn on your microphone. Madeline. Madeline. Present. Present. Alicia Carolina. I'm here. I'm here. Present. Okay, very good. Cecilia Yamilet Fuentes. Turn on your microphone, Cecilia. Present. 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 Okay, thank you, Cecilia. Daniel Osvaldo Perez. Present. Thank you. Eh, Veronica Beatriz. Present. Very good. Ana del Carmen. Absent. Okay, Andrea Alexandra. Flores. Present teacher. Okay, Present very good, teacher. Andrea, very good. Eh, Kenya Johanna Perez. Absent. Okay. And Vanessa Alejandra. Present. Okay, very good. Now, now that that is done, okay, let's see the exercises. Okay. In the book. 
exercises. Where are you, exercises? I can find you ah, right here. Okay. So, what is number two? Let's check. What is number two? Can we reduce it or we cannot reduce it? Yes, we can. Yes. Uh -huh. Reduce. The, reduce. The condition. The subject here is the manager. Manager is, is the same. Is the he. same. Okay, so we use this word. Remember, the only ones that we can omit are while and when. So this one we have to use. So before, what is the main verb? Before listening. No, listing, 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 listing. 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 Uh -huh. So the, listing. the present participle will be listing. Like listening. This. No, no listening. Listing the witness. Uh -huh. This verb the witnesses. is list. Okay? Listing. Listing okay. the, the witnesses. Listed. Listed. Now, the base form is list. Okay? And mm -hmm. if we add ing, it will be listing. Okay? Uh -huh. Yes. Okay? Uh -huh. Making a list. So that means listing. making a list. Okay, very good, very good. So let's go back to the book again. So before the ma before listing the weaknesses of the company on a slide, he had presented the new product. The rest is the same. Okay. Now yes. two. Now look. Okay. The, the the advert clause is this one. It's not this one. Because here is where I have the wire. Uh -huh, the time word, right? Remember the time word. So mm -hmm. I'm talking about Andrew. And here I'm talking Did about he? he, the same. He, subject, yes, it's right? the same subject. Okay, so Andrew kept text messages while now the member here is B. I'm gonna put it right here. Okay. Okay, so the verb is was in the past. What is the base form of was? The base form be. is be. So in present participle, being. Be. Okay, so that's what I have to use right here. Okay. Okay. Okay, very good. So what now? While being in a video conference. Now you I can omit while mm -hmm. Andrew kept and text keep messaging text. being in a video conference about the prototype. It's okay too. Keeping text. And now do you remember? Do you remember? We can use a here, we should use a comma. Because this is a very long advert clause. So the recommendation is when you have a long advert clause, try to separate with commas. So put a comma. Andrew kept text messaging. Comma. Being in a video conference about the prototype for the new product. Is that clear? Very good. Now let's go with number four. Mm -hmm. A question, a question. Yes. Yeah, what is your question, Melanie? Este, when the number three, keeping text messaging, uh, he, No, no, he, no keeping. Because no. This, this, is the, this is the main clause. The other clause is this one. This is the other clause. So this is the one that we are going to reduce. Not this one. Why? Okay. Because here we have ah. the time word. Okay, so this is the advert clause. Is that clear, Madeline? The long, the long. Ah, the long one, yeah, the long one. That's what I said, this. we need a comma because it's a long advert clause. Okay? Ah. So here we're gonna say, 
Andrew kept text messaging, comma, being in a video conference being. about the prototype. Okay? Um, Very good. Being. Okay, yeah. number four. Number four, it cannot, cannot, no, because uh, uh, it's different. Why? It's different. It's they not are, the same. Are not, uh, okay. they are it's not, not the same look, subject. Look. The subject says many promising product ideas. Uh huh. But so the, uh, ideas. They, what is the pronoun for they, ideas? There are a, they. Ideas. They are. Oh, in the same yes. subject. They is referring to are the ideas. They. Okay. To many promising, to many promising uh, uh, product ideas. That's what they refer to. Yeah. Many promising product ideas. Okay. So it's the same. It's the same. Okay. So many promising what, product what ideas short, are ruled out after after failing. Fail. Failing, uh -huh. after failing, that failing. is correct. Failing. Because oh. fail is in the present. Failing to produce, failing okay. to failing produce is positive. In the present. So, fail is in the present. So the past participle is failing. Failing. Okay, failing. okay so. Without look. comma, without comma. I recommend a comma because it's a very long, it's a very long adverb clause. So, rule out comma after failing to produce positive results in the soil. Okay? After failing. Uh, after failing. After okay, failing to good. produce. What about number five, guys? Mm -hmm. Number five. The weakness number five is, I, is, is different. Hey, sorry. Different. We, I'm going to leave number five and number six for homework. We're going to change tomorrow. Tomorrow, early, early. Thank okay? You. Now, let, I don't know okay. if uh, they ask you. I don't know if they ask you that today we have a support session from 10 to 11. So five of you, that you were informed that you were going to stay and they and they told you the schedule for example do you remember that now do yeah. you understand what i'm saying ah, se lo voy a decir yeah, yes. en porque estamos fuera de tiempo ah, yeah. todos los miércoles hay una support <laughs> session todos los miércoles hay una support session verdad de 10 a 11 Quiere decir que a cinco de ustedes los van a asignar. Hoy los asignar. Summer. Ya les voy a decir quiénes fueron ustedes. I didn't hear you well. Ah, ok. Todos los miércoles hay una sesión de 10 a 11. Y esto es una sesión uno a uno. Quiere decir solo con uno de ustedes por 10 minutos. Entonces cada miércoles van a... Eh, programar a cinco de ustedes el día de ahora no yo no el día de ahora ¿Sí? contactaron a mí vaya a las mí. vaya el primero va a ser me. Cader, cader. No, I want to leave. Es que no puedo porque ya están programados, ¿verdad? Y yo era a las 10. O sea, ahorita me voy a desconectar y se queda Yader. De ahí va, fíjese bien, de ahí va a las 10 y 10 va Blanca. A las 10 y 20 va María Eugenia. A las 10 y 30 va Bessie. A las 10 y 40 va Oscar. ¿Ok? Así que espérense, por favor, porque esto es parte del programa. Ok, vaya, me voy a desconectar. Me voy a desconectar. Y le mandaron la invitación, ¿verdad? No. No, no le mandaron no. la invitación. Teacher. No, uh, teacher, I a mí no. A mí no, teacher. Y, y me era ahora. 
Ahora a las 10. No, ya, la sí, yo ya de no, teacher, a mí no me dijeron. Un poco blanco, ni a Eugenia, sí. Le voy a mostrar que Eugenia, el sí. correo. Le toca, Verónica. Miércoles 26. Ah, ok. A, a los que le toca ahora, que es a número uno, Yader, de ahí Blanca, de ahí María Eugenia, de ahí Bessie y de ahí Oscar. Son los cinco. Yader y Blanqui no tienen el enlace. Solo oh, me lo pasaron God. a mí, Eugenia. Yeah. Bueno, entonces vamos con Yader primero. Ok. Hey, es Good parte. night. Ok. Vaya, voy a salirme de la sesión. Al resto les deseo buenas noches. Have a good night. Bye, no teacher. Teacher, good night. teacher, eh, y, teacher. Diga, diga. Este, a mí no me mandaron el enlace, es este mismo. En este tampoco. mismo, sí. Yo lo voy a cerrar a esta tampoco. reunión y abro la siguiente. Ok, y si no lo tiene, ya, ya le voy a mandar el Oye. Sí, porque yo tampoco lo tengo. Vaya, por un momentito, ahorita le voy a dar el enlace. Ah, que ya no se escuchó bien, ya se fue. Vaya, ahorita le voy a dar los enlaces Linda. a los que se quedaron, ¿verdad? El internet ya no... Permítame, ah. ahorita, ahorita, ya le doy los enlaces. Si no están poniendo... Ok, en agosto, me toca hasta las 10 y algo. Vaya, eh... El enlace, va, el ID de la reunión es 813-8527, es el mismo, es el mismo, solo cierro ah, es esta sesión y abro la otra, es el mismo, ok, ok, va, okay. solo uh -huh. cierro esta sesión y se une Yader a, a la siguiente, ok, va, okay. voy a cerrar esta, nos vemos más tarde, ok.